Yo, what's up, everyone? We are back from vacation. Um, went up to Lake St. Clair for seven days, smallmouth fishing with our group of guys. We had 16 of us. Um, awesome. We had a group from Missouri, Pennsylvania, Oklahoma, Mississippi. It was an absolutely incredible trip. It was pretty crazy. Um, it was an incredible trip. Got the boat cleaning it up it's disgusting we caught i don't know 250 350 fish pretty much throwing a couple baits which i'll probably go through later on the next video um just kind of doing an update i haven't shot a video in a week i didn't shoot any video on water i shot some live stuff on my facebook um just i just taking a vacation from doing everything doing baits reels um shooting videos all that kind of stuff so i'll go through like what we used um we kept it pretty simple if you saw my post i had a bunch of rides but it, it was a di different same time of year roughly but man the conditions were completely different from past years um it was awesome as you can see i'm just emptying out everything cleaning with the carpet cleaner i've got baits getting taken out graphs all that kind of stuff um active target uh, just trying to kind of wash and clean up the boat because it's absolutely disgusting. Um, driving home, we had an unfortunate just event. It started out with I had a flat tire on my trailer. Um, I don't know if you can see. There's a screw somewhere in the trailer tire. Um, there it is right there. I must have just run it over in the parking lot of the motel. So I've either got to get it patched or I've got to get a new trailer tire. Um, so we had to get that done. We got the, we swapped it out in the, the motel before we left, which was kind of nice before uh, getting on the road. And then driving home west of indianapolis i think it was on interstate 70. um we got very lucky my buddy steve and i um going through a construction zone and coming out of a construction zone um i was leading our, our group back and we uh coming out of the construction zone in a semi truck where they do like the lane shift merge whatever well he did not want to merge so he kept coming over and pretty much uh, sideswiped us, knocked a mirror, quarter panel, front, um, pushed the door, quarter panel in, so the door hits the, the quarter panel. So we had to temporarily tape this on so we could drive back so we could see lanes. Um, we got really lucky because the concrete barrier had just ended. So when I saw him coming over, I had to swerve into the median or cone area. Um, the trailer and boat are fine, but it absolutely, I mean, it scared the piss out of us just because you see this giant semi truck with this trailer coming over at us. Didn't know what was going on. Uh, we kind of had to run him down because I don't think he knew he hit us or he just didn't care um but we uh we boxed them in and pushed them off the road and then we had to wait for the state troopers and stuff to come just to uh, get a report and everything so now i've got to get that stuff repaired because towing is just much easier with the uh with the mirror um other than that just a quick update video. I'm gonna go in, I'm gonna take out some rides and do some updates on that. Um, it was great, the weather was incredible. Uh, we had pretty much 70s and 80s the whole week. We didn't have any wind. It was unheard of for up there. I mean, it's essentially just a small great lake up there and it's always windy, it's always blowing, it's always cold. Every year we've gone up there, it's been cold. We're always in like 15 layers, rain gear, all that kind of stuff. We were in shorts, sun shirts. I mean, we got sunburned. Um, it was a great time. We whacked the hell out of fish. So stay tuned for the next video. I'll probably drop it tomorrow. Um, we're starting up Tuesday nighters on the river, so I might shoot a little bit of that. So smash the thumbs up, guys. Post down below. Um, got very lucky on the semi swiping us. So um, it happens. It's just a truck. I can get that repaired. We just got very, very lucky that we did not get 
full rollover, smoking the concrete with this and flipping it over, whatever. So um, talk to you guys later and hope you guys have a good one. Peace.